guys, it's TJ from... From... Uh, Smiley Face Eagle Productions. Anyway, um, we make awesome videos. Uh, we have a lot of cool effects and stuff on our videos. So anyway, you wanna, um, I'm going to show you how to like make the uh, lightning in between your hands. And you kind of like, you can angle it however you want. You know, you can move your hands any way you want. Um, but keep in mind, like, the more you like mess around with it, the harder it's going to be and more complicated and stuff. Um, so we just want to go to File up here and go to Import, File. Then you just want to go to the file or, yeah, just the video that, you know, you're moving your hands around. And so it's going to it's gonna pop up right here. You want to drag it down here. Okay, and so, you know, you drag it around, and I look like a ninja when you make it really go, go really fast. It's pretty cool. I'm like, what's that? What's Anyway, so you want to go, you know, right where you want the lightning to pop up, whether it be, like, right here or, like, right here, whatever. Like right here, anyway. So I want it to say, like, say I wanted it to start here. Um, so then you, oops, click Control C, or if you're using a Mac, you know that weird like squarey thing next to the Apple thing on your key C. You want to click that C. And if that doesn't work, just go up here and drag down what you just barely dra drag down because they're both the same thing. So then you want to drag whichever one you want, um, whichever one's on top, I guess to exactly where you want the lightning to start. Then you want to drag the end of it to wherever you want the lightning to end. Um, I'm not going to do that right now, for just to save time. So anyway, you know, this pops up. And so you want to change the type of lightning type instead of, you know, having it to breaking or bouncy or direction. You want to have it strike. So that's so you can uh, actually move where the source and all that is. And then yeah, so then you want to go over here to origin and direction, and you want to click the stopwatches. So, and you can mess with it however you want. You know, you can go to uh, glow settings and say I wanted, like, orange lightning, or say I wanted yellow. I would click OK, and then lightning's yellow. Core, right. Have no idea what that sound was. Anyway, you want to go to, um, shh, just ignore it. Anyway, you want to go to glow settings. And you want to go to a uh, core color, and you can just change it. How okay, that that was distracting. What are, okay. Anyway, and then you can change the core color and um, kind of mess with the opacity. You know how how like if it's kind of faded or kind of invisible or whatever. And then the glow radius is kind of like you know super. Anyway. And then it's pretty time consuming, but it's pretty simple. You just click next frame. Don't click this because this brings you to the very last frame. You want to go to next frame, click it, and then see how my like palms moved? You want to drag it to there, drag it to there, then you go boom, then you drag it to there, then you drag it to there, then you know you go like this again, and you drag it to here, and blah blah blah. And it's gonna take a while. And the finished product. The finished product, whatever that noise is, should, if my computer actually allows it, end up looking a little like this. I kind of had uh, the core, whatever it's called, black, and the glow yellow. So anyway, it's, you know, you keep, an like, next frame, then animate to wherever the palms are, or if you want it coming out of your fingertip or your nose, just animate it wherever your nose is, or your eyeball, or your ear, or your foot, or your dog's butt, or whatever. So anyway, you know, and then it's going to end up looking like, hold on, just wait for it, wait for it, wait, wait, wait. Okay, anyway, so it's going to end up being like, Wacha! and it won't be as, you know, it's just because, whatever, what's that, okay, it quit unexpectedly. Anyway, so that's what's going to end up like, you know, if, however you move your hands and stuff. So I'm with Smiley Face Eagle Productions, which is awesome. Click on the My Channel to go to My Channel for you know, awesome videos that have cool effects, you know, I have like this one that's, me and my friend are making one where it's like a laser gun fight, and uh, we're shooting each other with laser guns, and then I have one that, an FBI, yeah, it's just really cool, and they like, you know, so anyway, go to my channel um, for some cool effects, um, The you can see the entire finished product of my um, little lightning thing, like, the, you know, the what I just did, and um, so have fun with it, 
if you think it's pretty cool, like leave it as a video response. Like if you, yeah, leave it as a video response to my video or something. So anyway, that's how you make lightning follow your hands and all that. So thanks for watching. It's my face equal production. We make awesome videos. Go to my channel. I also have one where I'm flying. Um, you know, and me and my friend are flying and we kind of turn invisible. We make a pill that we eat and it makes us fly and turn invisible and all that. And then you can just see us, you know. My friend, Space Cowboy, he's in most of my videos, just not this one. Um, actually, he's in pretty much all. And he's trying to learn how to fly and I kind of got it down. Anyway, it's pretty fun. Um, my videos are all kind of cool. So that's how you make the whole lightning thing. And you can make it how as complicated or as non-complicated like you can leave your hands still that'd be like the simplest because you wouldn't even need to you wouldn't even need to do the next frame next frame next frame because it would just do it for you anyway so yeah make sure you do all that so yeah that's how you do that thanks for watching smart physical protection